going on guys welcome back to another youtube video uh, in today's video uh, it'll be pretty simple i'll just be showing you how to get uh, the best performance using block strap on roblox um, i'll be giving you my flag list and as you can tell in the first part of the video that's how much performance i'm getting uh, with these settings it's pretty easy um, all you got to do is import it and i'll show you how to do it uh, in just a moment it's been like two weeks since I last uploaded. It's because I've been still dealing with stuff, but I still promised I'll be uploading. And um, to make it up uh, on Monday, there's also a scheduled video. So you'll be getting two videos um, this coming week. Anyways, uh, let me show you how to get these settings. So after joining my Discord server, uh, you would want to go to uh, the channel section. Um, after verifying, etc go to max fps scroll all the way down uh, this is my most recent flag list pretty much uh, go to this channel download it after you downloading um, open up the text file um, select all uh, and then copy everything here uh, then go look up block strap menu go to fast flags um, make sure allow bl a block strap to manage fast flags is on um, if it shows you a warning screen um, proceed Everything should not be on uh, the first time you open up Blockstrap's uh, fast flag menu. Just scroll all the way down where you see fast flag editor. Click this, click add new, import JSON, copy what you got from this text file. Um, pretty much just click OK, continue, go back and all these settings are set for you. I say keep the Roblox um, FPS unlocker which is the built-in unlocker, um, the one with 60, 144, 240. The reason I say this is because I don't really see any reason to have more FPS. Also, if you're on a laptop or a gaming laptop or any system that has port cooling, um, you will get stutters if you play on a high frame rate. So uh, capping it definitely helps. Um, pretty much um, if you do want to change it though. Um, if you want to unlock your FPS, set it to 9999 or any amounts, but uh, I put zero because, yeah, I, I'm, I'm fine with Roblox's uh, frame lo unlocker. Oh yeah, sorry for the stuttering, it's like 4 a.m. If you play a few games, uh, this is up to you what you want to choose. Uh, on Rivals, you can definitely put Voxel and you get a good performance while playing. But for me, I put Chosen by Game because you can play multiple games. Um, if you change sliding technology, it does break some game sliding. For example, doors can't run in Voxel, it only runs in future. Um, so yeah, I say uh, pick chosen by game. Uh, don't change it unless you play like one game and one game only on Roblox. Uh, and yeah, pretty much click save, uh, hop in the game and you'll be set. Okay guys, so uh, we're in a rivals game right now. I'll show you my FPS on the top left. Just to show you like a quick um, example of how the performance is when you're playing a game. Um, yeah, uh, not much to it. Just want to finish out this match and this guy's a sniper. I don't want to lose this shit, bro. GG. Okay, sorry. I had to lock it. I was about to lose that shit like an idiot. Um. Anyways. You can see the performance. The top left the whole time. Um, hope you guys liked the video. I'm going to end it off right here. Um, GG's. Uh, peace out.